Gabonese bishop and politician Mike Jogdan announced his candidacy for next year's presidential election. In his speech, the president of the political party Gabon Nouveau said he aimed to build a unified society and called for changes in the electoral process. I have always worked with faith and honesty to meet the needs of my Gabonese brothers and sisters. It is with this same faith and ethical mindset that I have decided to run for president to defend the interest of all Gabonese men and women. Mike Jogtain, 49, became famous in the early 2000s when young pastor he turned bishop. Shortly after, President Omar Bongo chose him as his deputy chief of staff. This 2016 presidential candidate says Joktan should be careful not to mix his two engagements. We simply ask him to be very careful not to slip from one camp to another or not to wear the same jackets at the same time. We all know that he is a bishop, but from the moment he commits himself to the battle of the judiciary, let him not brandish his quality as a man of God at any moment. During his press conference in the capital Libreville, the politician also insisted on the need of free and transparent elections and made suggestions which include the implementation of an electoral timetable. No date has been set aside by the Gabonese government, neither for the registration of candidates nor for the registration of voters. This also applies to the two electoral dates, that is, the first and the second round. Despite this, election mood has already set in with the likes of Mike Jotan, who has declared interest in running for presidency in 2023.